We find ourselves on the Akwazasne at the Mohawk Indian Reservation at Hogansburg, and I run across this very interesting billboard right next to the road on the eastern border of the reservation. And pardon the pronunciation, but it says roughly Tagani Ganrahowagan. Holistic Health and Wellness Program. Gambling is not our tradition. Gives you a phone number to call. Now the interesting part about this, here's a wolf's eyes looking at you. And symbolically, you can see that the gambling is drawing the lifeblood out of this poor brave. Here is the Haudenosaunee or Iroquois flag and a number to call if you have a gambling problem. Interesting. And interestingly enough, here we are just down the road from that billboard to the Akwesasne Mohawk Casino. And this casino was started now, don't quote me on this. I think it was started by Harris. And they started and just continued to add on. So this section was all added on. Also, this bingo hall, which you can see is no small event. That goes all the way down talking about maybe uh, two football fields. And this is the Bingo Palace. Mohawk Indian Bingo Palace. And of course an extensive parking lot which goes on forever. starting at the Bingo Palace they have added on to this there's the original casino and they've added on this foyer a casino running back in there more than a city block and then this unbelievable hotel Akwesasne Mohawk Casino now this is I think 200 rooms as I check in to the front desk, they're pretty much full up all the time. To say nothing about the Comfort Inn with another hundred and some rooms built right next to it, they're busy all the time too. So this is a casino. I'm not quite sure who put up the big money for this, but it was like a five or ten year payback that they had to work before they started turning a profit. It's massive. So starting at the Comfort Inn, we'll take a view and understand that the Quebec border runs right through this reservation. So this is Quebec and New York State at Aquisasne. And the Canadians were right up near the Vermont border. So Vermont, New Hampshire, all those people who don't have casinos or very poor places to gamble. They come from far and wide. Now part of what I like about the casino actually is some of the artwork that they have invested in is incredible. And we'll see these dancing bears all over the casino. But take a look at this eagle. That is just incredible. Like I was telling you, some of the artwork here is just phenomenal. Somebody really had some imagination. This is the entrance way coming into the place, and I'm actually doing it in reverse for you because it's a better view of the sky. And these, of course, are the different clans of the Iroquois Mohawk Nation. Now here comes my favorite one right here because I am a turtle. So there's the turtle clan.
And coming up here on the left is the Wolf Clan. Oops, that's more like the Sign Clan right there, the Do Not Park Sign Clan. Here is the Wolf Clan. And of course we can't forget the Bear Clan. And here is the Snipe Clan. And lest we for not forget the Deer Clan. So again, we're here at the Aquizasni Mohawk Casino and the Mohawk Gambling Bingo Palace. And we're on the upper edge of New York State and the very lower edge of Quebec. And Ontario isn't very far down the road, but also New England, New Hampshire and Vermont are just east of us. So less than an hour drive east of us is the Vermont border. So really out in the middle of nowhere, but still one heck of a casino. <laughs> 